In this video, I'm just going to show you how I would mix vocals like Dave East from scratch. All I ask is that you smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and let's get straight to the mix. The struggle real and it's not just me. These are wild times that we living in. Can't see eye to eye, we do not agree. While we killing each other, they gaining on us. It takes a village, but it can't be broken. We need good fathers off of child support. Know some single mothers who deserve it more. Pretty dope record, so I just wanted to show you guys how I mixed this one. Because I think it came out pretty dope. Alright, so for vocals like Dave East, I thought the uh, SSL channel strip, the V6 version, would fit nice with his vocals. They all pretty much sound the same, but I do feel like uh, this version and the other channel strip that I use kind of have like a, a tiny different sound. I'm not going to say it's major, but it's different. So I ended up uh, just going to these high frequencies first. At 7.50, I only enhanced about 2 dB. With the high mid frequencies, I only enhanced 1 dB around that, uh, I'll say 6,500. And then around 1,000 hertz, I deducted about 2.3 dB. With the low frequencies as well, I deducted out of 185, took 1 dB out as well. With a high pass to about 92. Now, a lot of people ask me, I'm like, do I EQ? This is pretty much me EQing. I'm just doing like minor adjustments to the EQ on the channel strip. Again, I just like work it on channel strips. That's just my style of mixing. But pretty much, you know, I just went to this compressor side. Uh, got this at like negative 12 dB. The ratio is at four and the release is at 1.5. Um, for the gate and expander side, I ended up uh, taking this hold to about 0.2 on this threshold to about 10. In the range and the release, pretty much, uh, maxed out for the compressor i felt like the um, uad 1176 se was just perfect so i ended up just slapping this on the vocal at a eight ratio and i have this input i would say around like that 20 and the output around that 22 with the attack at three and the release at five so just with the channel strip in this compressor let's hear exactly what this is doing to the vocal not agree why we killing each other they gaining on us the struggle real and it's not just me these are wild times that we living in can't see eye to eye we do not agree why we killing each other they gaining on us now you hear it's doing a lot of pushing so i'll be completely honest with you it's pretty much this uad 1176 but you can pretty much use any 1176 and probably get it to sound up front the way i did for this record next i went ahead and applied this oven now you know for the oven i'm usually just testing out new presets and just like figuring out what sounds that i can get so i ended up going to this preset um enriched it's pretty much the third preset on the list i can't remember exactly what all i adjusted here but you have the settings here but i do know that i just took this parallel mix and i took it to about nine percent next i wanted to add some just clarity into the vocal so i thought the mag for it was just going to be perfect so really i only adjusted i think uh this air gain to about 1 db i'm um, at 10k and then around 160 i took out 0 0.5 the struggle real and it's not just me these are wild times that we living in can't see eye to eye we do not agree why we killing each other they gaining on us the struggle real and it's not just me these are wild times that we living in can't see eye to eye we do not agree why we killing each other they gaining on us so it pretty much did exactly Exactly what I wanted it to do just gave it some more clarity some more life and the oven really I think it just gave us some more presence and some saturation I guess you could say next I added another compressor to this vocal just to beefing it up just a little bit more so I ended up taking this peak reduction here to about negative seven this ratio to about four the attack I would say in between the fast and the mid recovery around the same and I kept everything here at its default and then with the makeup we just pretty much just played this by ear so you just want to play it by ear don't don't turn it up too much because it's just going to be extremely loud out. So when I added that compressor, it just brought some of the frequencies that I did not want back into the mix. So I ended up uh, pulling up another EQ, which I just took this uh, top knob here to around 12K and took out about 5.4, but it's pretty precise. So it's not taking out like a big chunk. For this one around, uh, for this low mid range, I ended up uh, deducting around uh, negative one, around 550. And then I took away another 3.7, around 61 Hertz. Again, just taming the mix because that compressor did bring a lot out in that vocal. So just with the uh, EQ in the compressor, let's hear this on and off and let's see what it's doing. The peace, the struggle real, and it's not just me. These are wild times that we living in. Can't see eye to eye, we do not agree. Why we killing each other? They gaining on us in a piece. The struggle real, and it's not just me. These are wild times that we living in. Can't see eye to eye. We do not agree. Why we killing each other? They gaining on us. So to me, I can hear the difference. You may need headphones just to hear that on and off. Now to kind of make everything glued together, right? Ended up applying a deesser around the 7k. I made it wide. So again, my attention for this one was just to try to glue things together. And then I took this soothe, and I went to a preset called Vocal Warmer, and probably made some small adjustments. The main thing I just tell you is that I took this um, this mix now to about 65%. Don't know what I did too much to this preset, but you could probably find this vocal warmer in a 
the vocal section is what I'm assuming I used it at. Yeah, right here. So with the de and just this soothe, I'm going to let you hear these on and off just so you can hear what my attention was for me putting these two plugins kind of at the end of the vocal chain. The struggle real and it's not just me. These are wild times that we living in. Can't see eye to eye. We do not agree. While we killing each other, they gaining on us. The peace. The struggle real and it's not just me. These are wild times that we living in. Can't see eye to eye. We do not agree. While we killing each other, they gaining on us. So to me, everything just became so smooth. It, it was bright. It's still bright but then everything just kind of like got smooth so now for the vocal effects we'll start off with the ad-libs for the ad-lib i pretty much just put this plugin on here and just went to a preset called afrojack filtered space delay which i have it under my user preset so i must have got this somewhere or i must have just got it here yeah afrojack and i must have saved it and then i just adjusted some knobs here like the eq is at 3.9 the distortion is at its default but i actually turned that off turn on the uh, reverb got that to about 5.4 turned off the uh short delay and the uh, long delay is at 1 db and the pitch is at 5.8 for its doubles just to kind of like give it a different sound i ended up uh going to this uh meta flanger and went to this uh preset called soft spread my biggest thing that i like to adjust is the mix the feedback and the delay and sometimes the waveform so again you just play with those three sections and, and see what you can get from there now for the reverb and the delay i ended up using super plate super plate is a gem for sure for sure they they did it they did their thing when they came out with this pretty much just took the eq all the way down to about a thousand i have this around four seconds of decay went to the e plate three and kept this in the middle e plate three is pretty much like one of my favorite uh settings to go to when i'm using this reverb and no pre-delay and no modulation and then for the delay all i ended up doing was just taking this uh valhalla delay taking the mode to tape this year the future of course we got the one fourth delay that's kind of like one of my favorite timing when i'm doing vocals just the one fourth always works um the feedback is 54 percent the width is at 100 percent and this isn't really doing anything but i have this uh drive in this age here it's a 4.7 and i'm 6 db and then again my main thing over here is just messing with these knobs here so the low and the high and just adjusting to the song itself and just how everything is getting mixed and applied now with the reverb and the delay in that uh ad lib effect i'm gonna go ahead and turn all of those on and off just so you can hear exactly what this is doing on and off the struggle right. real and it's not just me Ooh. these are wild times that we living in can't see eye to eye we do not agree while we killing each other they gaining on us you know the struggle right. real and it's not just me these are wild times that we living in can't see eye to eye we do not agree while we killing each other they gaining on us and just with that you can be one step closer to getting industry vocals like dave east or just something similar or really for any type of rap vocal Again, if you like this type of content, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and comment below what type of vocals you want me to mix next. If you have those type of vocals that you suggest, I suggest that you book me at mixbyl.com and uh, I can make content out of your next hit. In a piece, the struggle real, and it's not just me. These are wild times that we living in. Can't see eye to eye, we do not agree. While we killing each other, they gaining on us. It takes a village, but it can't be broken. We need good fathers off of child support. Know some single mothers who deserve it more.